Is that a Moogle? You can see me, Koopo? Then you two must be very, very special people. In that case, welcome to the Moogle Emporium. I'm the owner, Moggy. You must not be familiar with Mog the Moogle. It's a pretty famous fairy tale. Mog wanted to bring happiness to all the Moogles of the forest, so he decided to open a shop of wonders. That's right, Koopo. I open a store to bring happiness to the slums, like Mog. And you know, only people with the purest of hearts can even see Moogles. Uh, you talking about me? Well, Moogle magic isn't perfect, Koopo. Anyway, we've collected all kinds of rare and wondrous goods. They can be yours if you've got enough Moogle medals. But you'll need to buy a membership first. If you find any Moogle medals, you can spend them here, Koopa. So, Moggy, what do you do with the medals we give you? Oh, you know what? I use them to make everyone happy. That's the duty of every Moogle. Of course, just like Mog the Moogle. I see you're working hard, Mr. Merc. Yep. So what are you gonna do next? Keep on working hard. As you always do, I'm sure. You know, this is how I earn a living. Huh? Really? I thought you were just doing it for fun. I suppose some people do. Hello, I'm some people. Nice to meet you. See anything you like? Until I'm happy. Go on, work your magic. Make me smile. From ear to ear. I'll need a lot more medals, Koopo. Well, that won't do. Come on, Cloud. Let's go get more. Good luck, guys!
There's a lot of problems we can't fix because we're just kids. And that's where you come in. You give me gill, I give you items. What'll it be for you today? Take care of my equipment, you hear? Shinra weapons are on the rampage. Five of them, like floating eyeballs. I saw them wander off into the scrap, but if they come back into town, it'd be a disaster. We need someone who's willing and able to fight. So, do you think this means another one? I'll handle it. You will? Oh man, you're the best! I could hear them shouting intruder detected or some other nonsense when they floated off. Be careful, they look dangerous. We could always run away, right?
too bright? Everything is spinning. <laughs> Let's do this. Time to burn. Gotta be careful. Okay. With your love and grace. No big deal. I got this. Let's 
switch it up. So it's my turn? Gotta heal first. I won't give up. This one's for you! Can you take over for me? Heal up. That's it. And catch! Gotta keep going. Do it. I'll show you what I can do. Don't catch a cold. One more shot. Bundle up. You've got this. My turn. I heard, I heard, you got them all, right? Robots from the reactor getting lost in the slums. Must be because of the explosion up top, huh? They must have thought they were protecting the reactor and figured I was trespassing on their turf or something. Maybe. I almost feel sorry for getting all lost and confused like that. Oh, what am I saying? Man or machine? Shinra bitches get what they deserve. Now hold on. 
Anyway, I think it's safe to say our work here is finished. If you're ever in the market for a merc again, remember, you can count on Cloud. Uh, sure. And sorry about putting this on you all of a sudden. I'm really glad you were willing to help out, though. Thanks again. Actually, while you're here, I've got another favor to ask. There's this old guy who hangs out in front of the weapons shop. I think he might need your help. Would you mind talking to him? Mercenary. I have a problem. It's the anniversary of my wife's death, and I wanted to visit her grave. But I can't because some creatures have turned the graveyard into their nest. Could you do me a favor and go there in my stead? She shouldn't be alone today. It'll cost you. That's fine, that's fine. The graveyard's right by the head of the river. But I heard they put a new gate in recently to replace the old broken one. Now that those creatures have moved in, I'm sure it's locked up tight. Didn't we buy a graveyard key off Moggy? I think we did. Hey, looking for a new weapon? Now you can handle yourself. What you need to stay safe? I don't have all day. Later. for all of your help thus far. I've done it. I've developed a new materia. future battle intel submissions.
Now that's just me. <laughs> Too bad. Pushing it. So it's my turn? Get him! It up. Come on, you can do it. Here it comes. I'll put it on. I'm trying, but I can't. Of all the times. What the? After you. We've got to get through this. Don't catch a cold. Get him. <laughs> One more shot. This must be it. Hey, you want to say a prayer too? No thanks. I think you've got it covered. for what you did. Here's your reward. I owe him a lot. Maybe more than I can ever repay. And now, I owe you a lot, too. I know it's not much, but I hope it makes up for it a little bit. We paid our respects to your wife, and we took care of those creatures. Oh, that's such a relief to hear. I can't tell you how much it was weighing on my mind. I was beginning to think I might never be able to visit her grave again. With my bad back and my legs, my whole body's a mess, frankly. I... I didn't think I could make it past the creatures. But I was prepared to die trying, and then you two came along. Still, I've got to face facts. Creatures or no, I can't keep making these trips. Don't say that. This is the graveyard key. Run it back to Moggy. But I just told you about my legs. Why don't you just give it back? Okay. It'll cost you 5,000 gil, though. 5,000? It's always money with you people. <sighs> Fine. I won't ask you for anything else. 
I'll take your damned key and give it to the boy. Oh, it's downright depressing. What is the world coming to these days? It feels good to help people out, doesn't it? Yeah. You having fun yet? Heaps. Then you can't be afraid to show it more. Don't forget, it's all about service and salesmanship. I'll leave that to you. All right, but don't think you can rely on me forever, mister. Wasn't planning to. That's good. Cause I command a very good salary. Flowers! Lovely, don't you think? Great job. That's wonderful. <sighs> Isn't it? Oh, I nearly forgot. I saw some Shinra suit walking toward your house a little while ago. He was dressed all in black. A little scary looking. aren't you? Cloud, was it? Former soldier turned problem solver. Are you okay, Miss Folia? You look upset. Uh, yeah, I am pretty upset. The kids are still off doing patrols, even though it's now time for their lessons. Not a single one of them has come back yet. Patrols? Is that a leaf house thing? Something they do to help out? That's right. In return for the donations we receive, the kids go around town picking up litter, running errands, that kind of thing. I don't suppose you've seen any of them, have you? Oh. You see, I have some important plans this evening, and I really need to go and get ready. Would you like us to go round them up? Oh, that would be wonderful. There are five of them out on patrol right now. They all wear homemade swords on their backs, so they should be easy to spot. on the streets than usual. Maybe because the reactor blew up? Well, you've been keeping a very sharp lookout. But 
Don't you think you're forgetting something important? Oh, Miss Foley of Lessons! I gotta get back to the house! something else you should be worrying about right now? I forgot about Miss Folia's lesson! I gotta head back to the house! I know! You're talking about Walmart and Archie! Now listen to me. You stay away from there, alright? sunshine on a cloudy day. Hey there. How goes the patrol? Great. I've been picking up garbage and giving people directions. Plus, I helped an old lady cross the street. You've been busy. It's a normal day for me. Gotta work hard. The house depends on people's donations. Oh, no! I'm late! Did you see Miss Folia? Is she mad? Oh, I gotta go! I'm sorry! Oh, you scared me! Hey there, how goes the patrol? I've been watching them really close. I'm trying to learn all about the business. You want to open up a shop of your own someday? Yeah, so I can earn lots of money and use it to help the house. The teachers don't like to talk about it, but we know the donations aren't enough to keep things running. Uh, but that's a secret, okay? I'm not supposed to tell anyone. Anyway, I gotta go study. times. A reactor blew up and a bunch of kids lost their friends and families. Who knows what might blow up next? I guess that means more children might be coming to the house soon. And I think the teachers are gonna have a whole lot more work to do. Speaking of teachers, Miss Foley is looking for you. Oh man, I completely forgot! I have to get back right now! That's everyone. Let's go back to the house. Hey, what will it be? That's what's called me. I don't think I know you. Come on! I'm very soft. The children finally came back, thanks to you two. You've been a great help. Okay, everyone, come inside. It's time to hit the books. <sighs> you guys, the Toad King's back. I saw him near the hideout. We gotta do something about him. The Toad King? A weird, creepy monster we've seen near the hideout lately. He wears a crown and walks around like he owns the place. If he's not a king, he's gotta be monster royalty at least. 
I bet a soldier could beat him up easy. Oh, yeah, real easy. But here's the thing. I don't work for free. Or cheap. But we don't have any money! The watch wouldn't ask for money. But if we ask any other grown-ups for help, they'll find out about the hideout, and that'll be it. We really don't want to lose the hideout. Come on, help us! Oh, and we'll give you some cool treasure if you do. And if that's not enough, I'll pay the rest of your fee once I open my shop. Well, if you won't help, then we'll just have to kill it ourselves. I'll do it for three gil. Huh? I'm offering a special discount right now on Toad King jobs. Looks like it's your lucky day. Awesome! Now that's my kind of bargain. The Toad King wants to take over our hideout. He's mean and angry and smells bad too, so be careful. If I want to become a successful shopkeeper, I have to study super hard. The hideout is the only place that belongs to just us. I don't want to lose it because of some angry Toad King. I really like Miss Folia's lessons, and she's really nice. But she's also... So kind of scary when she's angry. Um, can I pet it? Nothing to it. Leave this to me. I don't think so. See ya. Let's go. Try to stay behind me. That way I can cover your back. Come no. on! That's that. <laughs> Nothing to it. Easy. Just go away! <laughs> Let's do this. See ya. <laughs> Was never in doubt.
taken over. All right. Keep it together. Here goes. Hey, you asked for it. <laughs> That's it. Ha! This one's for you. Tagging out. I got this. Get no holding back. <laughs> one more shot. <laughs> After all that hard work, so much for studying. After all that hard work, so much for studying. Did you defeat the Toad King? Yep. Kicked his butt real good. Awesome! I knew you could do it! Now we don't have to worry about the King and his smelly friends. Thank you so much! Here, this is for you. The treasure we promised. It's definitely worth at least three gil. Okay, kids. Playtime's over for now. I've prepared a special assignment for everyone. One that I expect you to finish today. Understood? Uh, yes. Yes, Miss Folia. I appreciate you getting rid of the Toad King, by the way. Wow, Miss Folia. You must know all their secrets. Oh, if only. Easier said than done. They're always on the move, looking for new adventures, chasing new dreams. All while trying to make the lives of everyone around them just a little bit better. I try to make sure they don't stumble and fall. And when they finally do, I help them back up. Hmm. Sounds exhausting. <laughs> Sometimes it is. But I want the children to know that until they can stand on their own two feet, that I'm here to support them, care for them love them that even if we're not actually related we're still a family a real family in all the ways that matter if i can do that for them then well then maybe i'm making this world a better place i know you are my predecessor taught me everything i know i just took up his torch and ran with it i guess uh not that i'm anything close to what he was biggs is one of a kind completely lost track of time do you have somewhere you need to be more like a dream I need to fulfill thank you again for your help I wonder what kind of dream she's chasing tonight no idea thanks again for saving our hideout from the king in return I let everyone know you guys can join the game as special guests if you want to know more then come to the hideout
stop telling us stories about that damn reactor. Now that things are starting to settle down a bit, we can finally play Whack-A-Box again. It's all thanks to you. Oh yeah, I forgot. There's this tired looking guy out by the community center, and I heard he was looking for some help. the most boxes is crowned champion of the hideout. We usually don't let adults play, but since you're cool, we're gonna make a special exception just for you. Become strong just like you. He doesn't see me. Be quiet.
Uh, you wouldn't happen to be a certain merc that's become the talk of the town? Yep. I'm Damon. Little more than a humble reporter with the daily buzz. Ah, uh, that rag? The one that's always printing awful rumors about the slums? On the contrary, my dear. We strive to raise awareness of the plight of our undercity brethren. We seek a better future for everyone, rich and poor. Now then, my friends, I find myself in need of your exceptional services for a trifling matter. Are you familiar with the mysterious and notorious bandit known as the Angel of the Slums? She delivers written declarations to her victims, usually Shinra associates, before divesting them of their valuables. Everyone knows her. Everything she steals, she gives to the poor and needy. Yes, she's got a knack for public relations. Very popular down here as a result. Nevertheless, she is a criminal and a threat to the public order. I've made it my mission to unmask the villain. But the locals have been uncooperative and uncommunicative, to put it mildly. And now that my identity as a reporter has been exposed, my sources have all deserted me. Which brings me to you. Work of the hour, and the man who will serve up my scoop. The angel gets in and out without... No, no, it's no magic trick. If we're going by rumors, well, I could talk all day about the dozens of stories I've heard. I wish I knew it. Those avalanche people were thinking. Good to see you again, Murray. Good to see you, too. Cloud, meet Murray. Meet... Mm -hmm. Here, the kids are... And now the hero... I am. <laughs> Not looking into it. Oh, could it be? Anyway, but I'll need a moment before I can give it to you. Why don't you wait with that report? A book made by... You could see the sky? I've heard about you. You've been helping people around town. So, any news? Have you tried talking? Mireille, as in, I chased her for days begging. So how'd you get the old... This old bird. Then quickly, has she struck again? I don't know anything about her. Base of... Deep in the... Sp Look out, point. But before you go... Oh! Quite large. Lots of teeth. Oh, oh well... <clears throat> if it's a plan... So, my good mercenary, if I might get close... Get back. I can fight too, you know. I'm coming! <sighs> Kinda hurt! My turn. That's it! That's that. See you around!
Don't overdo it. So it's my turn? One more shot! Why don't you lead the Taking way? Taking over. Here we go. Too bad. Keep it together. I'm coming. How shocking. You jittery? You've got this. Let's do this. No holding back. Get <laughs> Buzz off. Come on, you can do it. This one's for you. Just taking a I little break. That's it. One more shot. Buzz off. I'll take care of them. Shit. How shocking. You jittery? Can you take over for me? Hey. I'll show you what I can do. This one's for you. You've got this. Hang back. Take the lead. Sure. However I can help. Hey, it's your turn. Let's do this. Gotcha. Guardian Angel of the Slums will collect your offering on behalf of the poor. This must be one of her calling cards. I don't see anything else interesting. Let's head back and tell him what we found. one of her calling cards this is the genuine art hmm. it's an incredible find. hold on looks like there's something else to the nosy shinra report i was planning to teach you a lesson you would never forget but next time he might not be not just a message from if not sorry about that here i was just trying to help you out now now 
In any case, I hope this narrowly averted trap. Hey, everybody! The angel left another calling card! It's about damn time! Don Corneo's no easy mark! I can't wait! Excuse me, I'm a reporter! So much for my reward. Here, why don't you take this? Oh, and no need to thank me. Let's just say it. <laughs> can't call it theft if. Well done, Mr. Merck. You certainly lived up to your reputation. We probably ought to call it. Getting late, huh? You've been working so hard. Had to. Because they didn't know if you were. Come on, let's go home.